hello guys so in this video i am going to show you how you can run c++ programs in your system by installing minjw64 which is a platform for which we in which we can run c++ programs there are also many youtube videos which suggest you to install minjw32 bit version but it is not recommended because sometimes you may be getting a lot of errors while using c++ standard template libraries and etc So follow me, go to the google chrome and type in mngw64 mngw So here you will be getting, go to wikipedia You have to remember one thing, wikipedia contains all the official websites So here is a website press on this this is the official website go to downloads here coming down you will be seeing mngw64 builds press on that you will be seeing installation sourceforge by clicking on this you will be redirected to sourceforge.net website so here you can see your download will start, start shortly zero the download has started and then completed it's of very little size 938 kb press on that click yes now you can close the chrome uh, press next you can leave this as default or else i'll be changing the architecture x8664 these all you can uh, leave it to default click on next uh, this you can leave it to default or you can change that's not a matter but i will be changing it because all my important files are on d drive click on d drive make new folder naming it as min gw okay click on uh, create shortcuts in start menu not required click on next it will be taking around uh, seven to eight minutes so till then you we have to wait while it is installing let us make a c++ program a simple program so i will be making a new folder Usually we have to run C++ programs after installing our GCC compiler from MinGW as follows G++ my.cpp We'll be showing G++ command not found so we have to wait until this 
installation has been will complete till now we can close this close this folder and let us wait for this as you can see here the installation has been completed click next to continue the installation next finish that's it go to my pc local disk d and then you can see mgw mgw w64 and then bin these are the required things to execute our c++ programs copy this location search environment variables environment variables uh, in system variables click on path edit new and then paste this here click on ok 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 that's it go to my folder my cpp you can use either command prompt or anything third party terminals like git bash i like this git bash uh, it is far more better than command prompt in my development process so here g plus plus my dot cpp gcc used for uh, compiling c program and g plus plus is used for compi compiling c plus plus programs enter so it will take some time first time right so it is taking a little bit more so you can see here na.exe file has been created executable file so we have to run that a.exe or else dot slash a.exe enter asking you for the name let me write my name abiram enter hello abiram so that's it we got it so in this way we can install minjira 64 thank you guys